right, we just finished stage one of Bob Love Across America 2011. This is a man uh, who knows a few things about finishing stages, Christian Vandeveld. So we just rode up here from Milwaukee, and you guys joined us in Kenosha, and we're real grateful for that. And on the way up here, your dad, um, we'll get to him later, um, was telling me about your younger brother and his um, special medical needs throughout the years. And I didn't know that about him. I thought we could talk about that in a second. Yeah, my, my brother was born with Ilya Atresia. Performed a Kasai treatment on his stomach earlier, on his liver, excuse me. And then uh, by the time he was seven years old, his liver completely failed in a liver transplant. And that one failed again, and he was fortunate enough uh, to get another donor when he got two liver transplants. So yeah, we did the whole, I mean, I don't know how my parents made it through it, and we stayed at the Ron McDonald House a lot here. And, Chicago, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, I mean, it was it's a pretty amazing experience to go through after you are, through, obviously, and uh, we're fortunate enough that we did make it through it, and Ian's 30 years old and bigger than I am, and sometimes stronger than I am on the bike, too, and uh, so, so yeah, it's, it's great, so it was easy for me to, to go out here, and uh, appreciate it, and I was really fortunate enough to have my dad come on and ride, ride with me today, too, and I'm sure you guys share your comment on, and that's what I'm here with John Mandeveld, who is man who stands in the middle of a long line of fine cyclists, he's Christian's dad and Ian's dad, for those of you who recognize Ian as the true cycling celebrity in the Vanderbilt family. No doubt. How many Olympic teams were you, were you on? I was in Mexico City and Munich, 1972. The, the thing that you and I were talking about on the way down here from Kenosha just blew my mind. First of all, I was excited to have you along on the ride for something that we're going to get into in a second. You know, um, when you told me about your other son, um, Ian, and his, um, his work on the body and, and the, and the uh, medical uh, focus he's had in his life from birth, I felt an immediate connection with him as a father. And um, I just, you know, you and I have been, you know, we've, we've existed on different paths in this medical field, but when you're looking at your son and, and there's something inside his body, Fix it. Yeah, That's yeah and, and you know, uh, and as we said, and Christian and I have talked about it many times, you can't ask why. You can't you can't say, oh, poor me. You just have to go through it and pray and, and hope for the best. And, and uh, God willing, it'll happen. You know, but uh, you don't know how bad it is until it happens for you. So you guys were you guys were in this in this medical world in, in the late 70s and the 80s. Yeah, yeah. Ian, Ian uh, was born in 1981, and then the had that biliary atresia taken care of right right then at birth, you know, like 10 days old, and then uh, and that sufficed for eight years, and then he had two liver transplants. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I ask me anything about a liver. Yeah, you know, I'll, I'll tell you. Yeah, <laughs> that was before the internet. You know? yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I really, uh, I really, I feel like you and I um, are kindred spirits in this way, because, uh, like I said, when, when one of your children is in, a different gravitational force than everybody else, and, and your family is in that same sort of other world. It, it, it just changes you forever. Totally. You have no choice. Totally. Yeah. It, it, you know, you it, before that, you think, oh man, this is a problem. After that, eh, it's not so much of a problem anymore. Yeah. I, I know what real problems are. You know, mm -hmm. and people are facing. You know, that I lived with in Ronald McDonald House for seven weeks. Those are problems. You lived it. Yeah. A lot of people here, you know, on, the, on this wonderful ride, did it, and you've done a great job. Jeff, you've done a great job with this. This is, this is awesome. Thanks, John. My pleasure.